which is the hormone that tells you when you're hungry. It also disrupts leptin production, which is the I'm full hormone. When these two hormones are out of whack, you never know when you're full. So what does your body do? It tells you to eat more and more and more. Dr. David Kessler, former head of the Food and Drug Administration, even appeared on CBS News exposing how high fructose corn syrup literally forces your brain to make you eat more than you should. You see, one thing our bodies are extremely good at is turning unknown substances into fat. The reason we do this dates back to how our bodies were designed thousands of years ago when we got our food by hunting and gathering because we never knew when the next meal was coming. Our bodies would store fat in case of tough times. When you consume things like sugar or high fructose corn syrup, things our bodies were never designed to digest, our bodies get confused. So it does the only thing it knows how to do with a foreign substance. It adds it to your waistline, love handles, or butt. So beware of any food that contains high fructose corn syrup. You might as well be pouring fat into your waistline. That brings me to my number three harmful food, cereal bars. Kellogg's Special K is marketed as one of the premier healthy cereals on the shelf. Yet, in Special K Red Berry's Chewy Snack Bar, sugar is a component of the second ingredient and then emerges again as corn syrup. Fiber One Oats and chocolate bars contain corn syrup, sugar, sugarcane fiber, and fructose. Honey Nut Cheerios Milk and Cereal Bars have sugar, brown sugar syrup, corn syrup, high fructose corn syrup, and plain old fructose. And that's a recipe for plain old weight gain, if you ask me. Okay, now that I've told you the three foods you must avoid, it's time for me to share my four natural fat loss helpers. However, before I do, I need to warn you, these four fat loss helpers can allow you to get away with eating more of the foods that aren't great for you. As